Anne's group home for eight years. We've been through a lot in that time. We have. And now you're finally leaving to live with your brother. My brother Gabe. It says here he lives in Haven Springs, Colorado. Is that correct? That's a big move. Do you have any plans as far as school or a job? My brother said I might pick up a few shifts at the bar he works at. So you'd be dealing with people? Maybe. Does your brother know about your... issues? Is that an official interview question, Dr. Lin? Alex, you know that I care about you. With everything that has happened, I just want what's best for you. He doesn't know. No one will once I leave this place. I'll just be a normal girl in a normal town. Gabe said to meet him at the bridge. I can't wait to see him. Holy shit, that's really him. <laughs> oh, what's the protocol for reuniting with your long lost sister after eight years? I'm not much of a hugger, but I'm really glad to see you. Oh, very professional. We're excited to have you aboard, Miss Chen. I'm thrilled to be here, sir. I can't believe you're here. Believe it. She's all grown up. And I missed it. I'm a lot taller, huh? Yeah, yeah. Time will do that to you. Are you ready to see the town? Hell yeah, let's rock and roll. I don't know why I said that. Me neither. <laughs> but I love the enthusiasm. Okay, the uh, Black Lantern is just up the street. I mentioned I live above a bar, right? Even better. How was the trip? You must be wiped. I'm good. The drive through the mountains was amazing. Eleanor, hey. 
Alice just got here. Alex, meet Eleanor Laith, owner of the flower shop, and honest to God, royalty of Haven Springs. Oh, it is so nice to finally meet you. Welcome. Oh. We are so glad to have you, Alex. Gabe told us all about you. I'm glad to be here. She seems nice. Yeah, she's great. A little quick on the draw with hugs, though. Yeah, no shit. Welcome to Haven. Is this the first official stop on the tour? Absolutely. If you follow me inside, you'll find our prize exhibit. Gabe Chen buys makeup flowers for angry girlfriend. Oh, I can't wait. It's gotten so-so reviews. <laughs> hey, Gabe. Riley, meet my sister, Alex. What's your greatest weakness? Uh, what? It's for a college interview. We've been debating this one for days. Gabe insists that I give an honest answer. It's always better to give an honest answer. And what's the alternative? Lying? Not lying, more like strategic half-truthing. Like I work too hard or I save too many puppies. They could smell that bullshit a mile away. I've been trying to warn her. Oh yeah? What would you do? I would be clever. Telling the truth only gets you so far. Oh, you hear that, Gabe? You're outnumbered. I'll never surrender. He'll come around eventually. Alex, help me out real quick. What do I get for Charlotte? Sunflowers are her favorite, but I read online that Lily of the Valley is great for saying sorry. What do you think? What uh, exactly are you apologizing for? This time around, maybe the toilet seat? <laughs> if Charlotte loves sunflowers, go with the sunflowers. That's what I was thinking. You know, if Mac brought me flowers half as often, well, he wouldn't be Mac. Is it still on and off with you two? Sort of. More on right now, but wait five minutes and ask again. <laughs> Put this on my tab? Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to just tell Mac about the interview? No, not yet. I'll handle it. Okay, your call. We can leave when you're ready. Sounds good. Might as well have a look around before we leave. Mandatory for any enchanted garden. Mandatory for any enchanted garden. Oh, no category for estranged brother you haven't seen in eight years because you were ripped apart by the foster care system? That's you can make anything pretty if you shove a bouquet inside. This gnome has been places. The tiny house movement is really taking off. I hope Charlotte likes the sunflowers. Aw, I wonder who they are. Cute, right? Yeah. Are those your grandparents? No, but they were like family. Alistair and Ava Murphy. 
Nana bought the building from them before I was born. Does anyone actually sit in the decorative store chair? How to Kill Everything You Touch, a flower book by Alex Chen. Ready. Thanks. See you soon, Rai. How long have you and Charlotte been dating? Mm, about three years now, I think. You must spend a lot of money on bouquets. She's worth it. Yeah. Watch your feet now. It's getting windy. My feet are fine. Wow. Good to know. Well, here we are. Wow. Just... Wow. Uh... What the shit is goat yoga? Yoga. With goats. Welcome to Colorado. Every time I see Molly in the... I bet Gabe keeps the flower shop in business all by himself. I bet Gabe keeps the flower shop in business all by himself. Gabe Chen. Flower delivery man. I know, right? Let me duck in here and smooth everything out. It'll only be a minute. I'll introduce you properly later. Once, you know. It's no problem, really. <sighs> it's gonna be longer than a minute. Trust me. Oh. Hi there. Gabe's your brother, right? I'm Ethan. Charlotte's my mom. Hi, Ethan. I'm Alex. What you reading? Ninth Warden. Oh, has she found the Scepter of Serenity yet? She's looking for the Scepter, but I think she'll need the Bangle of Vanishing to get to it. I wanted to turn invisible so bad when I was a kid. Still do sometimes, to be honest. You can get away with anything if you're invisible. And no one can stop you. If you like comics, I can... show you the one I'm making. I'd love to see it. You can keep it if you want. I made a bunch of copies to sell in the record store. This is awesome, Ethan. I can't wait to read it. Are you going camping? You know the mines? I know they exist. There are a bunch of old tunnels all around the mountains. I think I found a way into one. I mean, I'm not an expert on old mines, but that would scare the crap out of me. I just like to explore sometimes. It's no big deal. Oh man, I shouldn't have told you that. I know we just met, but be careful out there, okay? You don't need to worry, really. I think I'll check out that record store. Nice meeting you, Ethan.
This place reminds me of the shop Gabe and I used to go to. <laughs> He'd save up for weeks from his shitty car wash job just to buy us something to listen to. It's crazy. Here I am, years later, still waiting for my big brother in the record store. Except this time, I'm buying the record. No way. Citizens of Haven Springs, that was the Wednesday with Bomb Squad. Up next, a very special request from some chick. Sorry, the store's actually closed right now, which is confusing because it's obviously open. Wait, are you Alex? That's me. Wow. Gabe's been talking about you coming since... forever. I'm Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Nice to meet you. So, all the way from Portland, huh? What do you think of Haven? I've seen some cool things so far. Like, this record store is amazing. I didn't expect anything like this here. Yep, it's our cultural landmark for sure. So the store is closed, but they opened it just for you? You must be picking up something pretty important. Yeah, well, you could say that. An outdoorsman's guide to the calls of common birds. Wow, that's... Not what I was expecting at all. It's a pretty obscure record. Hmm. The National Park Service gave it five stars. <laughs> so, you're a... Colorado State Park Ranger. It's all coming into focus. Well, bummer the store's closed. I was thinking of getting a gift for Gabe, but I'll figure something else out. I don't even know if he still listens to records. He does. Charlotte just got him a record player for his birthday. I'm pretty sure he put something on hold. So you don't work here? Steph won't mind. It'll be the easiest sale she's ever made. If I could just find the whole list. Hmm. <laughs> Damn. I know I saw it before. Want to help me look? Oh, yeah. Any ideas on where to start? No idea. Steph leaves stuff all over the place. Ninth Warden hero of the intergalactic peace wars, and friend to lonely children everywhere. Huh. Colorado digs its alt-rock, I see. I love that this town has their own radio station. Chores are an excellent way to learn personal responsibility, Alex. Valkyrie, 
That's one badass cat name. Wait. Is that the hold list? You couldn't have curled up. I don't know. Literally anywhere else? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm surprised you got out of there with both your hands. Thing is, she's sitting on the hold list. We could use her toy to lure her away. If we can find it. Give me a hand. Gabe's record is in here, but which one is it? Perpetual motion. Looks exhausting. It's been so long since I've played. Is it wrong that the note makes me want to touch it more? Looks like Ryan might need some help finding that toy. Any luck finding that cat toy? Not yet. So, what's the prediction? What do you think Gabe listens to these days? I think Gabe's gotten so emo that he doesn't like instruments anymore. Just dudes screaming and crying into the microphone. Dear God, let's hope not. <laughs> well, there's only one way to find out. Let's see if we can find that cat toy. A good place for toy safekeeping. Surprisingly not covered in stickers. You could check the register. Okay, but what if it's three unbroken hours of improvisational jazz flute? That he listens to while writing scathing film reviews. Yeah, and sipping a $50 Americano. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Alas, no toy. Please have the toy. The suspense is killing me. Maybe that drawer? It could be Celine Dion's greatest hits. You mean the essential Celine Dion? She is a Canadian treasure. Mm, nothing. Prime cat toy real estate. Maybe in the junk box. And we have a winner. Good guess. <laughs> Be safe out there. If I die a horrible cat-related death, tell Gabe I'm sorry. You couldn't have curled up. I don't know. Literally anywhere else. Who's the superior mammal now? All right. <laughs> Good idea. Thanks. For a guy who lives in the woods, I'm pretty good at this customer service thing. Should have known. Wait, seriously? Gabe and I used to listen to records together all the time. We'd forget about the world and rock out for hours. You gotta tell me what Gabe was like as a kid. Any ammunition you can give me? Actually, he was a pretty badass older brother. He smoked cigarettes, which at the time I thought was awesome. And he somehow managed to get his first tattoo when he was 12. Damn. 
The legend only grows. <laughs> All right, you're looking at 20 even. No, no way. I can't believe you're doing this no. again. Come on. Do you have any idea how much time I've put into this? You just... No, dude, I can't come over there. I'm working. <sighs> it's called a job. Maybe you'd understand if you ever had... I can watch the boost if... You gotta get out of here. Hey, hold, hold on a sec. Are you serious? Well, you have a playlist, right? I think I can handle that. <sighs> You're a lifesaver. Oh, no bird calls, though. I'll be there. One sec. <sighs> Organizing a LARP shouldn't be this hard. Are you okay? Sorry, I was just a little thrown for a moment. Thanks. You got it. <sighs> Somehow I knew I'd find you in here. Things went well with Charlotte? Thanks to your help. I can't wait for you guys to meet. I think you'd be great friends. Speaking of, my two favorite people in my favorite place. What have you guys been up to? You know, talking about bird calls and bird call related media. This guy really loves his birds. Guilty. You know we're trying to keep her in Haven, right? Anyway, I'm glad you two met. Not only is this dude my best friend, He's the best guide to Haven you could ever find. And this dude hands me the best beers? <laughs> hey, by the way, Mac was in here earlier and uh, he really wants to talk to you. He knows where to find me. Anyway, my shift starts in 20. Ready to go? Tag along? I'll catch up. I got a radio show to host. Week to the to last, last dope. dope. Hell yeah! Had a boy, boy. No, we gotta talk road trip next. It's a long drive to Denver. Denver. Are we driving Steph? We'll see. She's a GM, GM so she's, she's gonna be in Denver pretty early. early. What are you doing tonight? Mom says I'm supposed to stay at the lantern until she gets out of work. But, but I, I kinda I wanna hang out at home. home. Is that, Is that okay? okay? Got homework later tonight, tonight though. though. Better be done, Gunny. Capiche. Capiche. Good to meet you. Yes, yeah, same. same. See, you See you around. around. So, so weird, weird seeing you do the dad, dad thing. thing. Dad, dad thing? thing. No. No, 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 no. No, no, I'm better than dad. dad. I'm like dad, dad, dad plus. plus. <laughs> we trust, we trust each other. other. He tells us he, he doesn't tell, tell Char. Char. Ethan didn't tell Kate about, about going to explore the only line. He trusts me to keep the secret. Should, should I? I? Or, or should I blow love cover? cover? You good? Yeah, fine. fine. Just, just thinking about, about you or the hobs, hobs to you, Ethan Exactly. That's exactly, exactly what it would like. like. Except that you're 
you know, you know date me, mom. mom. <laughs> Clearly, you haven't read my top ten about all fan fiction. Wow. wow. What? What? What do you say we get each other then? Oh, you've been, been before. 